Welcome to Sheep Suit, the home of grazable Christian thought. Today's brain graze, why I don't smile much. Poverty, war, and injustice, that's why. I'm not acting very well, but that's why. Nobody can be happy until everyone is happy. So I fill myself with self-righteous rage and I never smile. Well, we Christians are supposed to look for reasons to be thankful, not be angry. We're supposed to, to find ways to be happy, I think. I can't quote an exact scripture, but that seems to be the, the gist of a lot of the mental health scriptures that are there. But the reason I don't smile much is because I have braces, and I don't like the way I look when I smile with braces. I'm not going to smile now. <laughs> I think you can see them anyway. Some might think that I'm too old for braces, and I thought that too, but orthodontic technology has advanced a lot. And I was given an offer to have braces for one year and give my teeth a reset, so to speak, for the rest of my life. So I took it. I originally had braces for 10 years from 8 to 18, which is a long time. 10 years is a long time now, and it's a really long time between the ages of 8 to 18. It's like my whole childhood. I had too many teeth for one mouth, and I had to have multiple teeth pulled from one side, and then the other with some not even having um, broken the surface yet. And that was a horrific thing for an eight-year-old to go through. Then multiple stages of orthodontic treatment that lasted until my freshman year of college. When those braces finally were taken out of my mouth for good, it was amazing. I I'd almost thought I'd have them for my whole life. I didn't really even see it coming. All of a sudden I was done. So over the years, my teeth kind of got a little out of line again and one tooth down on the lower row got way out of line. And I was given a chance to get braces for one year and bring everything back in line again. So I decided to do it. But I don't like to smile a lot. And I'm afraid I might get a video all done and uploaded and find a piece of broccoli or something stuck in my teeth or have someone else find it, worse, because I, I missed it in my pre-recording self-inspection that I always do. Do you remember, for some of you Gen Zers, um, although it's, it's on streaming as of now, which is great, the uh, Rocco's Modern Life, the Nickelodeon series from the 1990s, I love that show. There was this episode, season three, episode 12, Scrubbing Down Under, where uh, Rocco gets a piece of spinach stuck in his teeth and he gets on TV with it still there. Well, that lesson stuck with me. So from now until sometime in August 2023, I won't be smiling much. Hopefully I'll be smiling a little more after then. That's all for now. Keep the wool out of your eyes.